Okay, so Bitcoin has kind of like here, I'll pin this tweet at the top, has been historically thought as like an inflation hedge, at least in the United States for a while. Um, do you still think like that's the case or do you think like the, or do you think the case is being made even more right now? Or do you think, um, you know, it's, uh, I don't know, becoming more so of like a digital currency opposed to like an inflation hedge? I mean, I, I think that it becoming a digital currency in and of itself kind of like is intertwined with it being an inflation hedge. Um, I, I kind of see those just overlapping one another. You know, part of the reason that it's taking predominant form of, of currency in our, our economic system um, slowly but surely is, is the fact that, it, you know, it, it hedges against inflation and it's other monetary properties there. So I, I definitely see this as being just no matter how they fudge the fucking numbers there. It, it's um, a stronger case than ever for Bitcoin, in my opinion. It's just one of those, you know, you guys can go ahead and keep spreading the numbers if you want and keep, you know, misappropriating things and just kind of like smearing it to make it look not so bad. But people are starting to really realize it. And I mean, you, you can't, no matter how you fuck with the numbers, you can't basically tell people what they're paying at the gas tank is different than what they're actually paying. And when people are paying, you know, $6 or so at the gas, you know, at the gas pump, they're, they're going to notice, man. Like, I, I've actually been joking recently the past couple of weeks when we've gone to the grocery store. Um, I haven't been able to find any pasta for under a dollar a box, which is something that has, up until literally two weeks ago, always been something I could find. Like, it was, it was just no problem. Something that was just a, a constant. Like, the era of dollar pasta is over. And, like, I said it jokingly at first, but, like, no, like, that shit's, like, it, it's really affecting things. Um, and, I mean, just to go from a dollar to a dollar twenty-five, that's a 25% that's a increase. That's crazy. Well, I, I know gas has been very public, um, you know, especially lately. But uh, today I drove by and I just really noticed it. Um, I saw it like, I mean, I'm in Tampa, so it's generally like pretty good for gas prices. I remember about about, about a year or so ago, um, about a year or so ago. Oh, Jesus. All right. About a year or so ago, it was like getting under two dollars and fifty cents, and uh, today I saw it at four twenty nine. So um, it was, uh, yeah, I mean, two, almost two dollars a gallon um, increase mm -hmm. from from that that period of time. It's nuts. And then, yeah, I mean, I agree. I'm going to the grocery store and I'm buying the same exact stuff that I usually buy, and it's my grocery bill is like fifty bucks more. So, oh, yeah. yeah, no, I'm, I was. Shit, I was telling my brother, I'm like, bro, we're going to have a couple of weeks here where uh, it's going to be rice, some sort of veggie, and, like, maybe a protein, and we're going to make that stretch um, just to make the bills go farther.